Hey guys, Andy here. Welcome back to my Rebe I'm, I'm Red Dead Redemption 2. Let me set guys right back. Good morning, Craig. Right. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow, bud. Alright, so let's go fish with uh, Kieran here. Ah. Be going in a little bit, guys. Yes. We're running off to Como Driscoll. Of course not. <laughs> I was joking. <laughs> That's very funny. <laughs> yes, yeah, very, very funny. I saved your life, and now you torture me. Ho, oh, oh. ho. Shut up. Do you want to go fishing with me? I found an interesting spot. We'll do well. I'm not a great fisherman. But I am. <laughs> I'll teach you something. We come? Sure. Sure. All right, then. Grab your horse and let's go. Got it. Around the waypoint. Hey there, girl. Okay, follow me. I know a great little fishing spot along the beach. Looking for a good place to drown you. Because, because I saved your life, Arthur. Uh, you keep saying that. But I save your life every day I don't kill you. So we are more than even on that front. Come on, you don't mean that. You better believe I mean it. Where's your spot? Uh, there's not much further. Uh, no, it's got no, no dialogue boxes. Oh, shit. Sorry, Kieran. This is the place. It's a beautiful smallmouth here. Bass? Sure. Alright. This strip of shore looks perfect. It Items, got it. Spot. Seeing lots of bluegill and bass over here. Come, babe. Eat with worms or crickets if you got them. Otherwise, maybe some bread or cheese. Bread. Try to debate and often never before taking a bite. Yep, I got it. You getting many bites there, old Driscoll? I ain't an old Driscoll. I told you fellas a hundred times. I'd only been with them a couple of months. I was just a runner, helping out with the horses mainly. Bottom rung of the ladder. And I think that was the high point of your career. Home goes through men like cigars. They ain't like you folks. You barely knew my name. I'm more Kieran Vanderlyn than Kieran O'Driscoll at this point. Honest to God. Mostly I'm I'm Kieran Duffy. I hate to break it to you, but I ain't sure Kieran Vanderlyn is gonna stick. 
Oh, God, oh, God. Not too fast, you could break the line. Good catch, Arthur. Thanks. Thanks, Kieran. What we got here? It's a violet. One three bluegill caught. Now see if you can hook another. Alright. Bait. So, you think Dutch trusts me now? <laughs> That's a good one. What? Not in the slightest, my friend. I can't win. I promised loyalty. He says, but you wasn't loyal to Cone. If I say I ain't got no allegiance to nobody, he says, how do I know you won't turn on us then? I don't know what you want to hear. I'm trying hard to feel sorry for you, but somehow I, I just can't manage to. What in the world? Arthur, are you seeing this? I thought I was naked as a jaybird. Arthur. Is that why you like this spot? Hang on. Oh, There's somebody in these hey, fucking fashion. Hey, watch the line! Oh, hey! I nearly gulped down a minnow. Sorry, fellas. Didn't see you there. Why don't you take a break? Come on in. The water's wonderful. Um, I'm good. Sorry, dude. You here for some fishing? Yep. I'll buy him some bait. I, I think this is the place that naked fellow was talking about. Sure. 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 That got you really excited, <coughs> huh? Come on, Arthur. Let, let's walk down to the beach. I hope we land this monster. Uh-huh. It ain't easy to catch a fish like that with bread and cheese, but uh, you never know. We might get lucky. Guess we'll see. So who taught you how to fish? My pappy, mostly. I lost my mammy and peppy when I was young to cholera. Your mammy? Like I said, I was real young. After that, I was on my own pretty much, but I knew horses and fishing. Well, uh, just think now you'll never be alone again. Got it. 
You got it. That has got to be the one, right? It might be. Putting up one hell of a fight. That's not the big one we saw. It's large mouth bass. Ah. See? Look at this. I feel so bad. At least you ain't tied to a tree. I'm still a prisoner, Arthur. I can't step outside camp by myself for a second without being terrified of one of Combs boys gonna come pick me up. When I'm in camp, I got Bill and Sadie whispering in my ear all the time they're gonna kill me in my sleep. It's like living in a nightmare. Christ. If I'd known you were gonna moan this much, I'd have never mm -hmm. said yes to this. So if you if you accept this track you can arm from that. I don't think we have much chance. We need better bait. You might want to see if the stores around here sell anything better. I think I'm gonna head back to Camp Arthur if that's okay. Sure. Go on, I'll see you later. I need some bait or something like that. So... Fellas, ah. mind me, passing through. Yeah, if you set fish back into the water, you gain honor from that. Alright, I'm almost to, to high honor, no doubt.
Looks like one piece of damn rat suit. <coughs> I'll throw in that fish, no doubt. Mm -hmm. I was going to sleep, no doubt, too. I'm not sleep myself. Hey, John. Hey, Javier. Might as well keep the reserves as full as we can. Gain honor from that, too. This is going in the pot. What else we got? Many thanks, Mr. Morgan. Everybody's singing. Like, hey, what for two in the goddamn morning? Contribute. Give all debts. Robot Ledger. Next in line, huh? The largest been upgraded. A fast travel map and additional grooming supplies are now available. Also, a fast travel from the personal camp. Say. Distillation, huh? He might dead. I need some dead eye. Oh shit. Need some dead eye. Kentucky bourbon. Kentucky bourbon. Okay. Pull miracle tonic. We need that. Those loans are coming in. Are they? Good. Check the box. Yeah. 
Klansman. Carbon Peter. Shooting at me still. They're dead. Bastards. Forty three cents. Moonshine. Moonshine. Wow. This is a discussion. Ever see a man die to a Oh, for God's sake, bro. Head off. Better run for it. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. Morning, partner. Morning. Ignore the bodies, all right? Ignore that shit. For God's sake, I'm out of. I'm out. I'm out of fucking here, dude. Murder.
He's in dead eye. He made me dress up like this. He's got me chained to the goddamn foot. All right. I'm on it. I'll help you. Welcome. Your first time in my shop? Been a mite suspicious about the new faces in town. Rhodes is welcoming to be sure, but we can't just let all types have their way. Oh, hey, that's a piss Paul move. I want to see what's in that basement of yours. Show me. Right now. Nothing or no worse down there, I swear. Well, why don't I be the judge of that? Open it now. All right, all right. I got nothing to hide. I got my boy sleeping down there. It's such a shame to wake him. You know, you could always come back after he wakes up. I saw him. So I'm gonna save him. From you, buddy. You just stay away from me. I don't wanna tell you about talking to your pa that way. That's him? Oh, oh thank God. He can't see I only do it for his own good. Just what the hell is going on here? He was being a bad little boy, stealing candy from the store again. It's for his own good. Not your little boy, you bad son of a bitch. Please, please help me. He, he's got me chained up here. Don't take him away from me. He's all I got. Please, don't listen to that maniac. He, he ain't my father. Why? 
Are you wearing that sailor suit? That crazy maniac put me in it. He thinks I'm his kid's son. Kidnapped me, he did. Do I look like a kid? <laughs> Always in such a rush to grow up these days, aren't they? Don't shoot me, please. Just, just leave us be. I'll help him out. I can't lose him. No, the chains. Not again. Shoot the chains. Hey, he said the chain, didn't I? Not oh, fuck it, I'm out of here. I'm gonna loot this stuff. The the father of his son not enough for you? Oh shit! Oh, what we got here, eh? Set shoot the chain. No, I'm I'm out of here. Fuck you. Set the chain. I shut the chain off, dude. Oh. Do I have to? Fuck it. I'm going. I'm going to rob this guy for second place. I'm taking the things as payment. Thank you. Where's Dutch exactly? Oh, for God's sake, bro. Don't mind me, folks. Where's Dutch exactly? In here. God, God damn, I waste all that shit for nothing. Ah. Fuck, bro. Fuck. Oh, now there's now he's got it. I'm using dead eye. Of course, of course. Oh, and here is my dear friend, Arthur Callahan. Boy is a hunter. Boy is a killer. Arthur, you've met but not been introduced to Mr. Oh, I'm so sorry. Sheriff. Well, how are you doing, sir? I'm fine. Tough business you boys had. We did? Well, there's no need to pretend with me, sir. Life can be tough. So it can. And no man owes another anything. No, sir. But still, I feel you were hard done by. Losing your employment like that? But still, here in Rhodes, we have work enough for honest men. Oh, that's some strong stuff. Still. Don't seem to be doing you any harm, I guess. Exactly. Whoa. Excuse me a moment. I told you we was moving up in this world. Deputies. You have finally lost your mind. Amongst these drunkards, hillbillies, and slavers? Good honest thieves like us. We're bound to be moralizers in a place like this. Oh, Sheriff Gray, you are bad. Now listen, sir. 
There is shine in them woods, though, and it has cost in this county its good name and the state a whole lot of income. You boys wouldn't mind rooting it out. Maybe we'll make you permanent. I gotta set me down. A Not a problem, sir. Not a problem at all. You are in safe hands now. And people waste time with the temperance movement. Liquor never dulled a good man's senses. All right. Arthur, you... Uh, I'll check my Greg, I'll be checking in with uh, Kevin in the morning. Before I come in, so. Uh, ju uh, just in case, you know. Yeah, it, it can change. Shoot him at night 50. I know this is what you told me. Oh, brother. This is. I'm screwed here. I'm gone screwed. I'll check with Kevin in the morning. I'll check with Kevin in the morning before I come in. Yeah, he agreed to it. I miss being there. I miss being at work. I miss it. Other arrangements, I suspect. Ride with the deputy. Bill and I will follow. All right. Climb on up. Let's go. Archibald, how are you? Pretty good. And your friend is behaving himself? Oh, <laughs> yes. I think he's learned his lesson. Congratulations on becoming a temporarily deputized citizen of Scarlet Meadows County. Most towns just get bounty hunters to do their dirty work these days, but Sheriff Gray believes the law should keep the law. Now, I'm sure I don't need to remind you. Oh, there's you Rose. There's She's falling. Here. There it is. Dang straight, there is. Mm -hmm. This is a dangerous business, but follow my lead and you'll be just fine. Sure. Hey! Archibald wants to remind us he's in charge here. Of course. Who else would be? Well, you were a big help with them Anderson boys, and I put in a very good word with the sheriff on your behalf. We appreciate that. We rounded up the others soon after. I'm pushing for the rope myself, but that's by the by. So, these moonshiners. Not just any moonshiners. Braithwaites. Oh, God. I told you about the Braithwaites. Pretty sure yeah, you yeah. did. Old Cotton family had a fortune at one point until, well, a few changes in the labor laws. Now they're dealing in moonshine. We found their stills hidden all over Lemoyne. Quick as we destroy one, another one pops up. You could call it a pitiful fall from grace, if they had any grace to start with. I have no time for tax dodgers. Not to mention the fact that Catherine Braithwaite has a rather expensive interest in thoroughbred horses to maintain. But I heard something about it being gold these families were fighting over. Well, that's the rumor. Hey, uh, the Grays and the Braithwaites think the others stole a fortune from them. But it happened so long ago, I don't know for sure if it's true. Must be tough being rich, huh? <laughs> so I imagine. Yeah! That bed rather suits you, Mr. W. Yes. I thought so, too. Does it feel good to be back at it, serving your country? 
I wouldn't go that far. Whoa! Oh! Hold up. You see that wagon? Yep, I see it. That, that don't look right. No, this must have happened recently. Mm -hmm. Hey, come have a look at this. Look, suit and tie, one bullet clean through the forehead. My money says this is the handiwork of a gang called the Lemoyne Raiders. Hey, I ran into them. Yeah, I've run into them. Let's see if we've got any identification. Okay. We should get going. Yeah, we gotta get going. I'll send someone over here later to clean this up. I'll take the reins this time, Archibald. Taking the reins, I want to have a look at these papers. Sure, I'll direct you. Okay, Frederick Mitchell, Lamont State Legislator. Poor feller. Yes, he certainly smacks of the Raiders to me. Bunch of ex army free staters without an ounce of respect for the law. That's seven government officials they've murdered this year alone. Go right at the crossroads. Yep. Not the nicest fellows in my experience. Oh, and I know the Braithwaites are in business with them. No shame. Trash begets trash, my Uncle Reginald used to say. They're right again here. Got had a few stories, let me tell you. Town preacher and town sheriff. Easy. We oh. ain't that much of a hurry. Drink a sailor under the table before breakfast. He had one tiny hand like a child's on the end of a grown man's arm. But anyway, this tells you what kind of people the Braithwaite's are. Selling moonshine to murderers. Here we are. So what was I saying? Something about the Braithwaite's, I think. Even saying that word makes me sick. Hey, Rose. I'm going to need my carbine repeater, my Lancaster. Anyone we find here, we bring in the line, understood? Round them up and take this operation down for good. Come on. Let's see what we're doing. So, we'll get this mission done and then we might go fishing or hunting later on. tell you boys what did I say I said this place was crawling with vermin and we just found ourselves the rat's nest our excellence as they say in Paris our excellence my aunt she went to Paris back in 78 oh, handle this well the way I said actually put my friend here beside he doesn't have your fine way with words but he is definitely the man for the job let's see let's split up Arthur and Bill me and Archibald you boys want right or left? We're gonna go with, uh, right. We'll take the right. Let's stop these filthy, degenerate tax dodgers. The cheek of them. A fine idea. Hush. Remember what he said. We need them alive. Let's just knock them out and then tie them up. Got it. Deputy Williamson. Look at, look, look at the bayou, bro. Look at this shit. Literally. I think I'm crawling in the mucking shit. Forget the rider. Don't round him up later. Get the other one. 
Um, I'll take the lead. You are here. I'll be with him. Okay. Make it quick. Take down. to the wagon. Good thing got my two guns and my two rivals with me. Yes, I know. Put the moose on the wagon. I get it. I get it. God damn. Shut up. Oh, for God's sake. Arthur. Dynamite, slip the dynamite, whip it. Plant the dynamite in the distillery. Ignite. Oh, for the love of God, dude, what the hell? Oh my God, Arthur. That's the last time I've been. Well, um, I think you're real funny, don't you? That is the last time I'll mention it, I swear. I'll Sons of bitches out. Fuck. 
last one, Bill. Oh, God, say one, one left. Let's find Dutch and get out of here. Fine by me. Well, let's go before any more show up. Shut up, Bill. I'm getting... I'm looking, fuckers. Snake oil. I think that's... I think that's, that's all I needed. How does it... Feel being a fine upholder of the law. Not that different to our normal life so far. Who are those colors? Not sure. Probably the people they were selling to. Guess we can't ask them now. I thought I was protective over my liquor. <laughs> well done. <laughs> well, Forgive me, but me and my men must return to our lives. Ah, seems like we failed to destroy the last of the moonshine. Sure. Would you like us to? Well, I normally take it for personal consumption. It's sort of part of the job. But I better get back home. Why don't I just take a jug or two and leave you boys the rest to show that there's no hard feelings on account of the war? We are all Americans. Of course. My cousin, Webster, he used to say some of us is not as American as others, if you know what I mean. Only I didn't quite. Come on, you degenerate, no good, white trash, hillbilly piece of scum. I know you, Billy Lime. Probably. You've always been a piece of crap. Come on, move. We have a lot of on the land. So stupid. A backwater. So backwards that even we are like geniuses. <laughs> Bill, get this stuff out of here. Come on, you ride with me. OK. Should I stash this somewhere near camp, Austin? I'll need my, need my hat. Yes, show it to Hosea. I'm sure he can find a use for it. Bit of trouble back there, Arthur? Ain't there always? From what they was yelling, I think they were the buyers. Old Archibald didn't ask too many questions, so neither should we. I ain't planning to. That wasn't worth the effort, though. Deputized and hiding in plain sight. These lawmen. These two families. I mean, I really think we can play this from all sides. It's got Hosea written all over it. This is starting to sound like the young Dutch again. What do you mean, young Dutch? I'm as strong as I have ever been. Hey, you know what? Why don't I race you back? Um, oh. I would love to, Dutch, but I got some other business to attend to. Oh, you do, do you? You know you'll never outrun me in the count. Anyway, I'll see you later then. Stay out of trouble. So, yeah, that's not any damage. I got bronze, who gives a shit? So, we got... Molly O'Shea. Honest mistake. So, yeah, that about does it. So let's head back to camp and that be the end of the video. Yeah. Yeah. Go. What the?
Yeah, we'll head back to camp. Oh, hey, Dutch. Race ya. Let's catch up with you. Let's catch up with you. Do I have to settle this? Get out of my sight now! Come on. You better make yourself scarce. I don't think so. <laughs> Asshole. Oh, get fucked, will you? Gun oil, we need that shit. Lockbox. Hmm. Oh, okay. Brush. Yeah. 
Not finishing activity with Javier this time. Sorry, Javier, but sorry, dude. We're not. Who's there? It's me. It's me, Arthur. Hope you make some money. Hey, Arthur. Can, can I have a quick word? Forty-four cents? You can't be serious. Yeah. Forty-four goddamn cents, motherfucker. So what's wrong with you, you old fool? Go sleep it off, you drunken buffoon. Excuse me. I've excused you quite enough. Hey. Go sleep it off, you drunk. Is that clear? Okay. Oh, is that a chill, dude? Okay. Whoa, how's that a chill, dude? We'll see you until. Uh, you come to arrest me, Morgan? Until noon. Except until noon, and uh, let's contribute, and now I'm at the end of it. Contribute. 44 cents, you gotta be kidding me. Give money. Fifty bucks, even. What do you think of the place? I don't know. So far, it seems okay, I guess. I think that there is rich pickings for some carpetbaggers like us. Is that what we are, is it? Avenging your father's death after... 30 years? There's gold, Bart. Gold. If you say so. Last one's one of those I those items maybe. Is there a fast of that? Oh, hey, Sadie, what's up? Sadie? Damn, she's looking fine out there, man. Let's find out what she's, what she's doing. That'll be the end of the video, I swear. She hasn't been thinking about for long enough, either. Uh, Sadie? Where you at? Hey, Sadie. There she is. Hello, Arthur. Everything okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Fine. No reason. Just making sure. All right, Arthur. Wow. All right, then. How much we got left? We, we can turn a hundred freaking dollars to it. That kind of, kind of shit there. Oh, this from Ben. No shit, I'm from Ben, anyways. Alright, so. That's what does it. I'll see y'all next time. Bye, guys. Peace out.